What are you doing with your life? You have lived a quarter of a century and have accomplished nothing. He is younger than you and has done so much more. Every moment in your life has been a waste. Your time is almost up. You make your friends waste their time. The clock is ticking, running out of time. You're nothing but a waste of time. What exactly is time? As the Cambridge Dictionary defines it, the seconds, minutes, hours, days, weeks, months, years, etc. in which existence is measured, or the past, present, and future considered as a whole. Take note that time is infinite, but why do we always hear words such as, you're wasting my time, how long will this take, I've been on hold for 45 minutes, this is ridiculous. Well, the answer is rather simple. It's because there are only 24 hours in one day, and people do have schedules to keep. We're humans. We do things such as going to work, going to school, working out at the gym, having lunch, human stuff. It's important to respect other people's times. We can't keep them waiting around. However, some people can get plain impatient. For example... Come on! I asked for no foam? And you couldn't get that right? Ma'am, I can remake it for you. It'll only take two minutes. Oh, forget it. I've had enough of you. And sometimes people use time as a weapon. For example... Sorry, we'll have to disqualify you. But thank you for your time. However, time can cause a lot of anxiety. Time anxiety is a real thing, according to psychology today. Believe it or not, being late to something or getting off schedule is not what causes time anxiety. It stems from the fear of running out of time. That fear also ties with the anxiety about meaning, as in the meaning of life. Think of it this way. Imagine that you are 25 years old, still getting through college and still working in a minimum wage job. Some thoughts that run through your mind are, what am I doing with my life? What am I going to do with my life? Some of my friends are married, have families, and are full-time workers already. I feel like I've done nothing but waste time. As you can see, it can get intense the older you get. One moment is 2010, the next is 2020. You're thinking more and more about what you've done, what you haven't done, what you should do, what you wish you could do. Stop! Damn, that got intense. But don't worry. This is a part of the video where we transition to the healing. Please keep in mind that what I'm about to share are just tips and recommendations. It is up to you to agree or disagree. My first tip to you is stop thinking so hard. Okay, maybe don't completely stop thinking, but don't think so much about the past, present, and future. There's a quote from Lao Tzu that I really admired. He says, if you are depressed, you are living in the past. If you are anxious, you are living in the future. If you are at peace, you are living in the present. The point is this, what's done is done. Just look at what you have right now and continue to build up for the future. Second, it's okay to take your time on things. We live in a fast paced world and society puts so much pressure on getting so much done in so little time. You don't have to do that. Just take your time and get done what you have in a slow, but steady pace. Yes, yes, I know. We have a thing called deadlines, but same concept. Plan your days ahead of time and get your work done in a slow but steady pace and you can reach your goals. More importantly, don't feel ashamed if you haven't made as many milestones as your peers. As long as you're trying your best to improve yourself, there's nothing to be ashamed of. Just an extra side note, never wish your time away. Every moment in your life is precious. A day in high school you wished away in your teens, maybe a day you wish back when you're older. Every hour, minute, second is a blessing. Hey guys, I hope you enjoyed that. Thank you so much for watching. I just want to give a huge thank you to Little Dreams Animations. She did such a great job of voicing the voices, the angry customer, and the judge. I really, really recommend her channel to you guys. You will not be disappointed. Well guys, I really hope you have a great one. 
Ciao.